Hey, how's it going, guys? Mr. Boss for the win here. And in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, I'm going to be talking to you guys about two hidden cars in Grand Theft Auto 5. Now, I use the word hidden loosely or with air quotes because the cars aren't actually in the game. One of them is an Easter egg that we're actually going to look at at Simeon's car dealership. And another one is actually code for a classic GTA 4 muscle car found within the Grand Theft Auto 5 files. So we're gonna talk about that and its possibility of coming to GTA 5, and of course, Grand Theft Auto Online a little bit later on. Now, big shout out to my friend Zach Cox TV. He's the one who informed me a lot about this and also to the Grand Theft Auto forums for finding some of these images that I'm gonna be using on the screen. Other than that, let's get started. So the first vehicle we're going to be looking at and the Easter egg in Simeon's car body shop is one that's been drawing a lot of attention lately. And it's actually on this bulletin board in Simeon's car dealership. And I'll put an image on the screen a little bit later, but it's got a few images. It's got like the uh, enough super diamond. It's got like benefactor. It's got a few sticky notes as well, but there's also an image of this red vehicle that looks extremely similar to the Chevrolet HHR, which is kind of like a mini SUV slash crossover vehicle and it's interesting because it's located with all those other car brands manufacturers and vehicles that we see in the game however this car is not in the game so who knows maybe rockstar was just using this car as a prototype or maybe it was content that was cut. We cannot assume everything we find, especially with the new opening of GTA 5 on the PC. A lot of more files and images are coming out. We can't assume that everything is gonna be put into the game. We can only assume that it was either maybe cut content or has the possibility of returning a little bit later on with an update or with some sort of DLC or additional content. So I certainly do think that this prototype version of the Chevrolet HHR would be a cool addition to Grand Theft Auto Online or even GTA 5. Now it's no super or sports car, but at this point, I'm just excited to possibly getting new vehicles at any time. It's been a while since we've gotten some new cars in Grand Theft Auto 5. I think even going back to like the Christmas DLC and even then to the last team standing DLC, but we haven't gotten any really great cars for a while now. And that's something that I'm interested in receiving. So hopefully Rockstar does deliver some time soon and I would not be disappointed with this like mini SUV Chevrolet HHR so it's pretty cool so up next we're gonna be talking about a classic Grand Theft Auto 5 muscle car most recently found in GTA 4 that has been found within the Grand Theft Auto 5 PC file so this is extremely exciting the car we're talking about today is the Tampa so I'll put this image on the screen right now. And another member of the Grand Theft Auto 5 community, ZZ Cool, was actually the one who put this up on Twitter. So I thought this was pretty interesting. And it's basically a bunch of files for the Tampa. And there's a bunch of things you can see, like attachments, like there would be in the Los Santos Custom Shop, like uh, a splitter, options for the grill. Uh, there's even a death proof option, which I think is pretty cool. There's also vehicle customizations like bug catchers. So that would be really awesome. You know, the Tampa would be extremely cool, especially if it was an armored version of the Tampa. Now I'm gonna show you guys what the Tampa could possibly look like. This is obviously from a Grand Theft Auto 4 mod, but nevertheless, if Rockstar adds any customization, even remotely similar to this, I think this has the possibility of being pretty cool. Not only is it a classic Grand Theft Auto car that interests me, but also it's the Tampa, which is awesome. And if it looks anything like this or has an armored modded version, that could be pretty cool. So anyways, I'd love to hear from you guys in the comment section down below about what you think of both of these quote unquote hidden vehicles in Grand Theft Auto 5, the Chevy HHR, and also the Tampa findings that could lead to it coming in a future update. Anyways, if you guys did enjoy this video, a like rating would be awesome. So if you could hit that thumbs up button, that would really help me out. And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you are new, you like daily Grand Theft Auto 5 videos like this. Without the way, guys, like I said, thanks for watching. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.